Um, hey YouTube, uh, just today I'm gonna show you just how and diff what different ways you can edit text on Adobe Photoshop. I already have one open and as you can see it's just a blank square. So what you wanna do is first you wanna click and just write what you wanna do. Text for example and then now first of all here you can it does you can do it here or later but uh, I'm just gonna put red for now. Let's highlight it first. My oh, bad. Red in there, and then you over here where the layer is. If you when you leave it there, it actually says what you wrote. So just like double click it, and these are your options for that layer. So first, what you can do is outer glow, which is what I kind of like. You uh, here where it says blend mode, just go to darken if you want black or lighten if you want white outline I'm gonna put black since the background's white right now opacity how visible just put 100% so you can see it and then we want it black now we can make this as much as possible so we can make it like very much or we can make it so it just like barely surrounds the text like that alright and as you can see now each text has its own little black background outline so now that it has the outline you can leave it like that then bevel and emboss obviously you see it makes it a little bit like 3d ish as if like light is shining on it from an angle um it's already at 120 I sometimes use 129 and yeah that's pretty much it it's pretty good here you can make it look like that or you can just put it back to normal make it look how 3d ish you want it color overlay that's what I was telling you about um you could change the color here too but since we already did it over there it's not really necessary and then there's drop shadow if you put opacity 100 you'll see that it drops the shadow wherever you put it and then you can just edit like what kind of things there is, like spread, size, but it, it kind of looks good when spread and size are lower. But and then if you want it to look more of a shadow, change the opacity, and there we go. See? So now then there's inner shadow, and that same thing, it's the same concept, but it's inside the text. And I don't know if you like that, then yeah, just put it yourself. But I don't think that looks appealing, not to me at least. And then here, maybe now we can have white. See how that looks. Actually, it looks kind of good. Look at that. See, inner outline makes it look kind of like all the more three D ish and so then there's gradient overlay that's just to make it look like as if it fades into a different color there's pattern overlay which makes it look all weird you can choose through like different kinds then there's stroke and yeah here are your options just like pick the color you want opacity blend mode it's the same concept as these other ones just that the main ones I use are outer glow bevel and emboss and cover overlay at times um well but I guess now I'm going to start using inner glow since it looks kind of cool and so yeah that's the different ways you can edit text and when you're done you just press ok and then just move your text wherever you want in there you just edit your text and it looks a lot cooler now instead of just just like just this now you can compare and you'll see it looks a lot better alright um... don't forget to rate comment subscribe and thanks for watching my video